everyone, welcome back to the Van Rider Games YouTube channel. My name is Jamie with Van Rider Games and I am here today to bring you our February video newsletter. We've got a lot to cover today, so let's just dive right in, shall we? The first thing we have to talk about today is Detective Saints and Sinners, the latest expansion for Detective City of Angels, an immersive narrative-driven board game set in the gritty 1940s Los Angeles. Uncover three different cases navigating the dark underbelly of LA as LAPD homicide detectives. But beware, as one player assumes the role of the chisel, aiming to thwart your every move. Will you unravel the mysteries of the city of angels, or will the chisel's devious tactics leave you lost in a web of deceit? Detective Saints and Sinners is available to order now on our website at vanridergames.com. Please do keep in mind two things. Number one, this is an expansion and you do need to own the base game in order to play it. So if you don't own Detective City of Angels, make sure that you pick that up as well. Also, this expansion includes the Cloak and Dagger case, which was previously sold as a single case pack which has been discontinued. Okay, let's talk about live streaming. Don't mind if I do. So I will be live streaming Final Girl here on YouTube on the Van Ryder Games YouTube channel on the second Wednesday and the final Friday of every month. We're calling them Wicked Wednesdays and Freaky Fridays because I love alliteration. Who doesn't? I'm gonna be playing through all of the different feature films through series one and series two. So our Discord members are actually gonna be voting on which set from which series I play each stream. So if you're not already, you should definitely join the Van Ryder Games Discord channel. The link is going to be in the description below. And uh, let's have some fun and hopefully, you know, I don't die. I don't know about you, but once I got one feature film for Final Girl, then I got another and another and another. And before I knew it, poof, I had everything. And so this month we are featuring our storage boxes. So we have series one and series two storage boxes for Final Girl, which fit all of the feature films, the play mats, the core box, and they don't come empty. No, no, no. They come with bonus features and cast and crew boxes. So if you don't already have the series one or series two storage box, well, you can check out the video that's in the description below. It's gonna tell you a little bit more about them, show you them, beautiful, they look great on the shelf. So if you're interested, now's the time. Last month, we talked about the Van Ryder Games content challenge. Throughout the year of 2024, every month, we are setting a new topic or theme that we are putting out to the community to get you to join in a little fun with VRG. So in February, the topic is get cozy with VRG, getting cozy with Van Ryder Games. And what does that mean? It can mean whatever you want it to mean. I've already made my getting cozy video, which I'll link in the description below if you need some inspiration, but it could mean whatever you want. So far, we've had people cozied up in blankets, we've had pets, we've had tea, we have all different sorts of things, and we're really excited to see what you come up with. And don't forget to tag Van Ryder Games, at Van Ryder Games, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, or at van.rider.games on TikTok, and we'll make sure to share your content. In January, our topic was to share your play, and we had lots of entries, and if you're interested, I've put them all together and compiled them into a fun video, which I will also link in the description below if you'd like to watch it. So I really hope that you join us for February, and I'd love to see how you get cozy with Van Ryder Games. Let's talk about conventions. So in January, we attended Tantrum Con. They actually hosted an entire Torna meal for garden guests, where they had a ton of different people play garden guests well they ate some beautiful garden salad and they had some soup and they answered some garden trivia and it was a great turnout and the participants had a ton of fun some lucky participants even walked away with a copy of keepers because they were so good at garden trivia it's almost as if they studied before they went because I wouldn't I would I don't know that I would know the answers to garden trivia I should probably study we also had our very own Julie attend the Dice Tower Cruise. And I don't know if anybody knew about this, but apparently on cruises, there's this thing where people leave rubber duckies. 
around for other people to find. I don't know why, but they do it. So Julie found some spooky looking rubber deckies and put some Van Ryder Games information on them and she hid them around the Dice Tower Cruise for passengers to find, which sounds just like so much fun. While Julie was on the Dice Tower Cruise, she also got a chance to read some of our graphic novel adventure junior books to some of the kids on board, and she ran a few sessions of Revenant Society, so there was a lot of Van Ryder Games fun happening on the Dice Tower Cruise, which we love to see. Lastly, for upcoming conventions, I wanted to talk about Hoop and Stick, which is happening from February 22nd to the 26th. Hoop and Stick is a charity-based convention that happens at Ravenwood Castle. A convention at a castle? That sounds amazing. So we're not gonna be there ourselves. However, Carrington Hess is going to be there hosting some sessions of the Revenant Society, which is our new RPG-based game that's gonna be coming to retail later this year. So if you happen to be going to Hoop and Stick or if it sounds like something that you're interested in, definitely check out those sessions because they're gonna be a screaming good time. And that's all of the updates that we have for the month of February. Once again, don't forget to participate in the February content challenge, Get Cozy with Van Ryder Games. Please feel free to join our Discord. Links are gonna be in the description below. It's a great place, a really welcoming community, and we would love to see you there. Please leave any questions or comments that you might have down below, and we'll get to those as soon as we can. But thank you all so much for watching. If you're interested in getting a written version of our newsletter, I'll put the link in the description for you to sign up for that as well. I will see you all next month with another newsletter, and uh, happy gaming. Bye.